Welcome, I'm ESL teacher Lisa. Class is in session. Today we're going to talk about phrasal verbs with the verb make. Let me first remind you of a clear definition of a phrasal verb, and we're going to look at a few phrasal verbs that are created by using the verb make. So a phrasal verb is a combination of a verb plus a preposition or adverb that together they create a new meaning different from the individual verb itself. So you have to consider that additional word that goes along with the verb to create a new meaning. And that new meaning is considered a phrasal verb. They can be very challenging to learn in English, but today we're just going to focus on phrasal verbs with the verb make. Let's go. Our first phrasal verb is make plus after. Make after, which means to chase or to run. Example sentence, the police made after the criminal. You might note the tense of the verb make has become made. So you can change the tense of the verb in the phrasal verb when necessary, but you cannot change the order of the words or substitute words. So it is okay, instead of saying make after, made after if we're talking about the past. So the policeman is chasing the criminal. Here we have an example of a phrasal verb with three words made away with. You need all three words and it means to steal. Example sentence, the thieves made away with the money. Next one, make it simply means to arrive or get a result. Example sentence, I thought you would miss your flight. I am pleased you made it. So made it again means arrive. So she arrived, so she was able to get on the plane. Make it up to. So here we actually have four words in this phrasal verb. You need all of them, even if it's a small little word. It means try to compensate for doing something wrong. So compensate means to pay. It could be with money, it could be with items, it could be with a service whatever it is to make the situation right. So perhaps you were arguing with your wife or husband the day before, you feel bad about it, or you realize you shouldn't have started the argument. What do you wanna do? You wanna make it up to. So he tried to make it up to her by bringing her flowers. So he's trying to compensate or pay back, basically to make a situation that was wrong, right. Maybe he felt he said something that wasn't right, or perhaps he felt he initiated the argument. Whatever the situation is, you're trying to make what was wrong right. Make of, it means to understand or have an opinion. And again, you need that little word of. What do you make of your new boss? So the question is really asking, what do you think of the new boss? What is your opinion of the new boss? Make plus off, make off. It's to leave somewhere in a hurry. It doesn't necessarily have to be for a negative reason, but often it is used in negative situations like stealing money. He made off when he heard the police siren, so he left quickly. So you can leave a situation quickly. Again, it doesn't necessarily have to be for a negative reason. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. See you in the next class.